Let's go back to Florida now. Ali Rafa is joining us from uh, outside the GOP retreat or uh, the retreat inside the retreat outside Jacksonville, I should say. So we were talking, Ali, about uh, the fact that there's been some division among the Republican Party uh, for, for a while now. But right now, there appears to be this focus on unity at this retreat. What are you hearing from Republican leaders on that topic there? Yeah, Aaron. Well, House Republicans here say they're stressing unity ahead of the midterms ele midterm elections, which are still over 200 days away. They say that will allow them to win back the House majority. But really, stressing unity is proving easier said than done. And that's because nine-term Nebraska Congressman Jeff Fortenberry was convicted yesterday of lying to federal officials about illegal campaign donations. So the big question now is whether Fortenberry will resign on his own or whether it will take House minority leader Kevin McCarthy to remove him from his position. And we heard McCarthy comment on this just about an hour ago during a press conference here. Listen to what he had to say. Uh, I'm going to discuss with him today. I think uh, he had his day in court. And I, I think if he wants to appeal, he can go do that as a private citizen. But uh, I, I think out of respect, you can let me talk to him today. But I think when someone's convicted, it's time to resign. And McCarthy said that he texted the congressman yesterday. He's hoping to talk with him about this issue today. So definitely something we're keeping an eye on, Aaron. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.